everybody, it's Matt from all over the lake. Make sure to like and subscribe. Today we're down here at Lake of the Ozarks. We're going out with Andrew from STL Catfishing. Um, I just don't like coming out here and wasting hours upon hours. This guy's a professional. He's going to put us right on some spoonbill. He's going to make it look easy. He's got live scope. He gave us the option of a uh, live scoping for him. We chose the trolling option because that's what I'm going to do on my own boat on down the road, possibly, um, if I have time to make it out here to Lake of the Ozarks. Um, so we're excited. Uh, hopefully we make an awesome video. So sit back, relax, enjoy, and get ready for some good times. I've been doing this for, I've been guiding for three years. And how did you, you know, end up? You know, doing like guide service work, like did your dad and uncle like just do a lot of that. fishing? You just nope, yeah, you nobody just I knew even never snagged. I just come down here when I was 16. Me and a couple guys load up a 12 foot tadpole boat with a nine and a half horse motor on it. Had us a couple rods and some weights and some hooks, and we went to town. Caught oh, yeah. our first fish, and it just kind of kind of came thing after that. It had to come every year, you know. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So all you have to do is watch these numbers here. One of you guys will run two rods and two and on my outside rods. So this one's 65, that one's 85. And it looks like you just got you got one hook on each of these. Two. Two, so there was another one down beneath. You see that? So there's two hooks. fish will you because he's slimy look at that cat is that the biggest fish you've ever caught yeah yeah even though you snagged it didn't technically catch it you snagged it i guess yeah here you want to i'll can i hold him up i'll show off the knees catfish oh look at this big beautiful catfish that they caught For the good times. Oh, you want to get it turned off? Oh. Ah! <laughs> he was, he was, they always do that. They they try to splash water in your face because they're angry. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, no, that's a decent. Something decent. It's going to pull down. Oh, another big catfish? <laughs> Just hold on tight because he's liable. To... Oh, yeah, that's a good size flathead. For someone, I, I don't catfish, so. You probably catfish. Oh, yeah. Look at that. That's a nice catfish. Good times. <laughs> All right, that's a big catfish. That's a fat catfish. <laughs> Very nice one. Channel cat have teeth. Flatheads don't. Oh, they don't. Look at it. But he didn't clamp that hard enough that it hurts at all. That's the biggest teeth he's got. They don't even hurt. So you just hold the flatheads by the mouth. See, uh, oh, in Oklahoma, <laughs> that's what they call a suitcase handle. In Oklahoma, you hand fish these. They call them suitcase handles. Whenever you go to put your hand in a hole, fish bites, grab his handle, and you pull him out. You want to do some of that today? No, thank you. You'd enjoy it. <laughs> All right, let me try it. Oh my goodness. That's huge. All right, thanks for the good times, buddy. That's a nice one. Wow. Are you going right. which side? You should go to this side. Okay, I'm going to put him in. Yeah. We'll get back to fishing. <clears throat> Was that fun today? Yeah. Thank you. That was a big fat fish. He said thirds. So okay. that hundred foot pole is about this part of 90 to about 30 foot deep. This is gonna be two feet. Probably. What what and then that's what the last two guys told me if I'm using a, which I'd rather use these because I you know, but ever those guys are like, no, these are what you want. And so I don't have enough experience where I've only used divers you know, five times. So. And then out here at Lake of the Ozarks, isn't it something like 80,000? They stock 80,000 annually, something like so that number. We actually called the uh, biologist right yeah. before season started because everybody's been talking about population decline and stuff. Yeah. And like us guys, we're not, we don't really truly believe that. So we call them. They claim that there's been no population decrease. They said every year, they put 15,000 fish in. Okay. And every third year, they let go 30,000. Okay. But it takes seven years for a fish from birth to be a keeper 34 inch fish. Yeah. And there, are they releasing just fingerlings? They're, they're just putting in the small ones? I think they're all like six to nine inches. Okay, I, I thought they were slightly bigger than the, you know what I mean? Yeah. But see, they claim that they don't reproduce in this lake, but I've caught them. Smaller than that? I mean, I've caught them literally their whole fish that long. I, I think what they mean by they don't reproduce is that, you know, it's probably a half a percent. You know, like it's a small percentage because there's not, it's not optimal reproduction because they're kind of like a salmon. They want to swim upstream, but some of them will end up spawning, but it's such a low oh, oh. Really? No, I want oh, you to- not on there. Did it come loose? Came out. Oh, there's a little fish, a little catfish. Just a little catfish. It all looks so good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just get him up here. Help. He won't even open his little mouth. Hopefully, he's alright. Do you want to let him go, Denise? You sure? Yeah. That was, because he's still fun, right? You're even just like catching this little guy, didn't you? <laughs> yeah. All right. I don't think so. Okay. No, it's a fish. <laughs> Big fish? 
You're gonna get it, Janae. I knew we'd have one soon. Yeah, yeah, use the rod. Yeah, use the rod. Pull, pull, and then reel down to it, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh goodness. <laughs> yeah, he's backing into it to help get this here. Arms are like spaghetti. Oh, okay, that's what you're doing. He's not even that big today. Well, no, I thought it was going to be like an 80 pounds. He's got a handle right on the front of his face. Oh, no. You really aren't gonna hold him? Oh, really? Seriously? <laughs> you want to hold him by his nose? Nope. Picky look just like this. No, I'm not going to. I can't. <laughs> they gotta be 34 inches, I guess. To right? the fork to the eye.
Oh, that was awesome. like hitting brick walls. You weren't expecting it. Well, I didn't expect you to I didn't expect third, me to third, get him in. I can't wait to tell Ken. Beautiful. Oh, that's awesome. See why we need live scope today. <laughs> that's awesome. With the live scope. That's so cool. <laughs> Several like tank males this year. I bet if we started live scoping, we'd have been that quick. Oh, yeah. Like I said, them two we caught, they did not literally take 15 minutes. Man, I, I just want to thank you. We had a great time, so I appreciate it. And uh, maybe, hopefully I see you again sometime, man. So thank you. All right, guys, we're all done fishing. Fish are cleaned up. We're going to head out and grab some lunch. We had a wonderful time with Andrew from STL Catfishing. I highly recommend this guy. I'd give him a call and book your trip now. Um, yeah, it was just wonderful. Did you have a good time? Yeah. I had a great time. I hope you guys had a great time. And so we're going to go get some lunch. I hope you guys liked the video. If you did, hit that thumbs up button and subscribe if you haven't already to see more of my content. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.